Hey, what's up, guys? Um, I got a lot of positive feedback on the first iPod Touch videos that I did. So I'm going to be doing another one right now. And on this one, I'm going to be doing uh, kind of short reviews on all the applications that I've downloaded from the App Store, both paid and both free downloads. So, uh, yeah, let's get started. First one I'm going to be doing is Super Monkey Ball, which is a... Uh, game that uses the accelerometer which is the tilt on the iPod touch and what you do is you get from platform to platform um, it's a pretty good deal actually it's ten dollar download from the app store but you get something like almost two hundred levels and uh... it's got really good gameplay really fun so when you get to the mode select you have main game instant play practice rankings or options so uh... let's try practice i'll just pick a random level you have uh... four characters to pick i i mimi baby and gone gone let's be gone gone Cool, and then you have all these different uh, lands or worlds, I guess they're called, to select from. Let's just do the first one because it's going to be kind of tough for me to do uh, from such an angle that I'm at. So uh, I'll just randomly pick 14, sounds good. What a great number. So really quick to load, actually. It's already done now. So uh, yeah, pretty good graphics, as you can see, um, especially for such a small device. Now, I'm probably going to die here because I'm at such a terrible angle. Yep, I'm dead. Anyway, um, so yeah, this is basically uh, Super Monkey Ball. Pretty quick, pretty easy, but it's a lot of fun. Uh, should definitely give you hours of uh, gameplay. Anyway, okay, I died a uh, couple times. Let's just bail out of this. Next application is going to be iDoodle 2. This is a free download from the App Store. Uh, pretty simple, that's probably why. All it is is basically just a drawing application, or paint, I guess. So I'll pick a background color, we'll pick a blue for our pen color. You can just, uh, pretty much just drawing. Pretty fun actually, once you get the hang of it. There's a couple different ways you can like make actual like scenery and uh, I'll show you guys some of that. So these are some of the uh, pictures that I've drawn when I was really, really bored. Okay, cool. Cool, so there's just a few of them. There's a couple pictures that you can uh, do when you actually get the hang of iDoodle too. That's a free download once again from the App Store. Next free download is going to be called Cube Runner. I showed you in one of my previous videos, but uh, I didn't really show you that long. And uh, it really wasn't a review of it, but here we go. You can do different levels, easy, medium, and hard. Let's just do hard. Start a new game. And this one also uses the uh, accelerometer. It's just a tilt game. It's also going to be pretty much impossible for me to play from this angle. But uh, yeah, it's a pretty fun game, especially to get into when you're really bored. Cool. I died once again. Uh, next download is going to be Lander, which is also a free download from the App Store. So let's try Lander. Cool. Lander's not working right now. Hold on. Let's try one more time. Okay. Lander's not working. Fuck Lander. Um, the object of Lander is to get the helicopter basically just to land on the helicopter pad. Pretty simple, but it's pretty fun to get a couple couple minutes of gameplay out of it, especially for a free download. Alright, next game that I'm going to be showing you is called Chromag Rally. This is actually a really great deal. It's a $2 download from the App Store. And uh, it features a lot of levels and a lot of different uh, gameplay options. So you have race. Now look at all these levels you get for two bucks. That's a lot. Especially because all the levels are pretty tremendous also. Okay, then you get all these carts also. So you have a lot of options actually for this game. You have diff two different people, Brog or Grag. So let's be Brog. And uh, this one's just going to be showing you couple seconds of the gameplay. This is also a tilt game, but on the side, see how it says F and R? It's uh, basically they've put the, I'm not going to go right, I'm just going to show you. It basically has put the controls onto the touch screen. So forward or reverse, so you push forward to go. Pretty hard to play from this angle, sorry guys. And then uh, this little wheel right next to the forward button is a brake, so I'll click that. Cool, almost fell. Anyway, so yeah, that's pretty fun. Uh, good tilt. So, yeah, there's Chromag Rally. That's, again, a $2 download from the App Store. Really great deal, I think, so uh, you might want to check that one out. The next application I have is called Tap Tap Revenge, which I've gotten a couple questions on. Um, this is also a free download, surprisingly, from the App Store. It's got a Guitar Hero-based kind of uh, gameplay rhythm to it. And uh, when you first download it, you only have like five or six songs with the package that you download, which kind of seems like it'll get boring after a while, but... Constantly, as you can see right here, there's new songs added. Or if you want to go to all the existing songs that have been adding, go to Download More Tracks. You can see all the different songs for different levels. I already have them all downloaded, so there's no new ones. But uh, yeah, 
there's probably now, and you, you start off with probably about like five or six songs, and now I have about 30 that I can play. So, uh, here, I'll show you guys one of the songs that you can play on Tap Tap Revenge. Let's try, I don't know, this song looks fine. Pretty hard to play from this angle. But, uh, yeah, right now it's pretty slow. Pretty slow paced, but, uh, this game can actually get pretty tough, I'm not gonna lie. Let's see if we can get to a fast part. So yeah, it's basically Guitar Hero. Um, you constantly get multipliers when you get a certain amount of notes in a row. Oh, this, I can't even see it from the single. Anyway, pretty fun gameplay, not gonna lie. But anyway, let's get out of this. <laughs> Alright, so there's a... Most of the applications, if not all of them, I've downloaded a couple more like Facebook or Spin the Bottle. This is pretty much the most stupid application I've ever seen, if that made sense at all. Um, all you do is you just grab it and just wham. Cool. What a fun application. That's free also if you want to, for some reason, download that. But anyway, let's go back to the homepage. So yeah, those are uh, all the applications that I've downloaded from my uh, iPod Touch. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you have any questions about the specific applications that I've downloaded, or if you want me to do a more in-depth review on one of the applications, I would be more than happy to. So just uh, ask me anything you need. Leave comments. Please rate. Uh, have a good day, guys.